Shanghai is largest uh, 50,000 bed temporary hospital fully operational. The largest uh, makeshift hospital in East China, Shanghai began treating mild and uh, asymptomatic patients of COVID-19 on Wednesday morning with uh, all 50 thousand isolation beds fully available. A local health inspector sent and a news briefing on Wednesday. Wu Qiayu, senior inspector of the Shanghai Municipal Health Commission, said that Shanghai reported why 1,189 new locally transmitted confirmed COVID-19 cases and two 25,141 new asymptomatic infections on Tuesday, are from 994 and 22,348 the previous day, respectively. Located inside the National Exhibition and Convention Center, the makeshift hospital began lifted limited operation on April 9. Shanghai has five city-level temporary hospitals for COVID-19 patients. Stay reduced a week to a week. We also told the press that the duration of treatment at such temporary hospitals in Shanghai has been reduced to one week. Since makeshift hospitals are first on mild and asymptomatic cases, Treatment duration can be shortened through adequate health management. Medical observation and symptomatic treatment, even with traditional Chinese medicine, which is recommended by the World Health Organization, she ended. Treatment duration can also vary based on individual health con conditions, such as personal resistance level of immunity and underlying diseases, a healthy inspector said. She also said nucleic acid tests should be conducted daily for every patient from the second day of their admission into a temporary hospital. For those who get to consecutive, consecutive negative nucleic acid test results with a simply interval of uh, at least 24 hours, the doctors will decide whether not or not to discharge them or end medical observation. On Tuesday, 334 people have been discharged from temporary hospital and 6,044 people have returned home after finishing medical observations but they will still be under observation and their residential communities will end it.